Hello everyone, welcome back to the Integrity Botanicals YouTube channel. Today we are staying on the Han train. We are going to be swatching some more Han products. If you know nothing about the brand, I have reviewed a few of their different products, but they are a newer cosmetic line that we offer on the Integrity Botanicals website. I always like to share colors with you here because I find that shopping for them online can be a little bit of a pain. So today we are going to be taking on their wonderful pressed blush formula. Their pressed blush formula looks a little something like this. If you caught the eyeshadow video, you'll be familiar with this sort of packaging. It is all recyclable cardboard. Um, when you turn it over, um, you will see that I've printed my own label here. That is one thing I have to say about these blushes is that the name is only printed on the carton, not on the back of the product itself. So you will just need to kind of get familiar in your collection. I just used a label maker to print out some names on mine because you know I share different shades with you here on camera and I think it's a little bit more important for me to keep my story straight and especially because there's no window where you could see through the color of these either. So there's five beautiful shades. They're all a vegan formula held together with this elastic so when you open it up there is your big beautiful pan of product. These are also formulated without talc. Talc is a product that you will see in a lot of um, cosmetic items to help bind the powders. Um, but theirs is actually made with an oil absorbing powder, which is rice powder, which is really fantastic. Not only that, they are also fragrance free. So if you have more sensitive skin, these are going to be fabulous for you as well as safe to use on the eyes. So you guys know, I really like warm tones on my eyes. So sometimes I like to just take a little bit of the blush I'm using, run it through my crease just to kind of make for a cohesive look, add a little bit of warmth to the eyes, all of that good stuff. So, um, you could also layer these with their multi-stick products. These are these multi-use cream products. I will be sharing that method with you. And if you want me to review uh, these guys next, some of my favorite products in the Han lineup, definitely let me know. So let's just jump right into these five beautiful shades. As always, I'm gonna have a swatch photo for you down below. I'm gonna show you me applying the blush onto my cheeks. That'll be super quick and easy. And then if you have any questions, comments, and concerns, you just let me know. So going lightest to darkest as we usually do, the first shade is Baby Pink. And Baby Pink is a cool toned pink. Uh, if you know this channel, you know these are not really my personal favorite shades, but it's a really nice, soft, everyday shade for a very light complexion that will just not detract from anything else. It'll just give you a little bit of life to the cheeks, nothing crazy, really, really subtle. But what I like about these powders and just natural blush in general is that even though this is a matte, it's not a really flat matte. It looks really, really nice and lifelike on the skin. Moving right along, we've got the shade Glory. Glory's got a little bit of shimmer to it, and this is a really nice peachy short sort of beige. This one, again, is probably a little bit too light for me. It's going to be for quite a fair complexion, but this is one I could definitely see using on my eyes. Just kind of map out that all over lid shade, add a little bit of something warmer in the crease. So it is also really great for that. Then we've got the shade Bloom. Bloom is also a very soft, more rosy pink shade. So it's not going to be as cool as that first shade Baby Pink we already talked about. We're going to get a little bit more color payoff here. So if you have a little bit of a darker complexion, this is something that you could use. But again, it's going to be that really neutral, really wearable sort of blush territory. Now kicking it up a notch, we are going into my favorite shade. This is the shade I'm going to demo for you just here in a moment. And this is the shade Coral Candy. This is another one of their more shimmering options. And of course, it's a beautiful coral. So it's a really beautiful just kind of marriage between a peach and a pink. This has a gorgeous golden shimmer to it. So you know what I'm going to say, right? If you're a fan of NARS Orgasm Blush, Benefit Blush, this is one that you are going to love. It's the one I'm wearing here today. Layers beautifully, not too much kick up in the pan. Perfect everyday sort of option. The shimmer in here is a little bit more intense though. So if you have more oily skin or incredibly large pores on your cheek, I would maybe skip this formula and go with the next one. And the next one is also gorgeous and it's the shade Carousel. So this is a very similar tone. It's a little bit brighter. So it's something that's going to look fantastic on a deeper complexion. It's almost got a touch more like neon to it, but it is still totally matte. And this is the softest, most blendable shade 
of the bunch despite it having the most pigmentation. I mean, it goes on like a dream. I am seriously impressed with this formula. Sometimes without that, without that talc or just depending on how they're made in the pan, they could be quite loose. And these are, but not like a crazy amount of kick up in the pan and not so much kick up in the pan where you, when you start blending it, it just kind of turns to dust and goes nowhere. They have really nailed that perfect in-between formula and carousel is one of my very, very favorites. Um, so that's it everyone. They retail for $18 each. I quickly, before we sign off and wrap up, I want to jump to the demonstration portion so that you could see exactly how this applies onto my cheeks, as well as show you that layering method with their multi-sticks. Hi, okay, so I did want to do a very brief demonstration portion of this video, just so you can kind of see how the blush applies onto the skin. I know we all basically know how to apply it. This is going to be really short and sweet. I'm going to be using my favorite shade, which I did mention to you all is the shade Coral Candy, and it's exactly what it sounds like, as you would have already heard from the other portion of the video. Um, and I'm also going to use the Air Perez. This is their blush and bronze brush. So any brush will do though. Just going to tap. You're going to see we get really nice color payoff here. You can dust off any of the excess since they aren't made with talc. Sometimes they are a little bit dustier, um, but that's a really quick fix. So I'm just going to kind of smile. I have no blush already on my cheek. And this color has like a really nice kind of golden shine to it that I hope is picking up on camera because I did already have highlight on. Take just a little bit more. You could see how nicely pigmented it is. It gives so much life to the cheek. So this one is without, this one is with. What I did also quickly want to share with you is that you can layer it with their multi-use products. I'm going to take the shade Coral, Hib Coral Hibiscus, which is a perfect match for that Coral Candy shade. And I will re be reviewing these as well. So I'm just going to very quickly apply this. This layering technique is particularly great for warm weather when you're trying to get makeup to last. Because since this is a cream, any of the powder that we put on top will just set that right in place. So you can see that applied like a dream. The color is super similar. So then once I've applied a little dusting of that, I will then go back in and do some of this as well. You could see it's way more intense. So I'm actually going to take my beauty sponge. This is the green tea beauty sponge from um, Jenny Patinkin. And I'll just soften those edges. But there you have it. Just wanted to show that these are so easy to use, so blendable. Um, even the more pigmented colors are beautifully pigmented and not at all intimidating. So I hope that this part was helpful. All right, everyone, that is it. That is my quick little review swatch demo of the wonderful Han Pressed Blush formulation. I have so enjoyed having this cosmetic line on the website. I do still need to review and swatch their multi-sticks for you. So that's a little bit more of a wider shade range. So I know there are only five here. If you were looking for more colors and you don't mind a really beautiful high performing cream, that's a great place to look. If you need any other blush suggestions, feel, please do not hesitate to leave me a comment down below. And as always, I've got a swatch in the natural light of all five shades for you. So if you're curious and you just weren't sure what the right shade would be, make sure to refer to that as well. But before you do, if you could please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe. I do upload new videos here every single week and I don't want you guys to miss them. If you wanna see more from Han, definitely let me know. If you want to shop the products, that's always down below. And we have a newsletter that you could subscribe to as well as all different forms of social media so that you can keep with us um, absolutely everywhere because we are everywhere and it's always down below. But thank you all so much for watching. Thank you so much for all of the consistent love and support. I hope that you all found this video very helpful and I will catch you guys in my next one. Bye.